Hello grade ones. We're here for our next lesson for our math unit of patterning. So far we've been talking about how to extend a pattern, what attributes are in a pattern, and today we're going to be talking about how to find the core in a pattern as well as how to name that core. As we've talked about a lot previously, a pattern is something that repeats over and over. We can't introduce something new into it because then it won't be the same. Simply, the core of a pattern is what is that piece that's being repeated? We're going to use these four patterns to help us find that and then name them. So let's like look at our first pattern here. Let's say it out loud to hear what the pattern is. The first pattern is triangle square, triangle square, triangle square. Now let's start by trying to find the core or what is it that's repeating inside of the pattern. So I'm going to take a look and I'm just going to try it out. I'm going to say that the part that's repeating is this. Oops. Now if I have it right, that means that whatever that is, is going to be repeated after it. So if I say that the core of my pattern is triangle, just triangle, that means it's going to repeat after it. So let's test it and see. Triangle, it's not a triangle next. That means I don't have my core yet. I'm going to try it again. Let's erase that. Hmm. I'm going to take a look at it and say, hmm. Let's see if this is the core of our pattern. If the core is triangle, square, triangle, that means that that's what's going to be repeated after it. So if I think my pattern is triangle, square, triangle, let's see if it repeats. Tri oh, no, it's not a triangle next. That means I still don't have it. I'm gonna try it one more time to see if I can find the core. Okay, I'm gonna try and see if the core of the pattern is triangle, square. If that is right, then I can find that repeating core over and over. So let's see. Triangle, square, triangle, square, there it is. Triangle, square. I have found the core of the pattern. Since I have it right, I'm able to go through and group the pattern using the core. There's our triangle square, triangle square, triangle square. We're going to try that with the next one. Let's say our pattern out loud. We have orange, purple, purple. Orange, purple, purple. Orange, purple, purple. Now it's two colors as our attributes inside of this pattern. So I'm going to make a guess and say that my core of the pattern is orange and purple. That's the two colors I hear. If I have this right, that means that right after the core, it's going to be the same thing again. So if I think my core is orange, purple, let's see if it gets repeated next. Orange, purple, it didn't work out. Let's try that core again. I'm going to extend it to add one more purple inside. Okay, now I'm going to try and see if the core of my pattern is orange, purple, purple. If I have it right, I'm going to see that same core right after it. Orange, purple, purple, and orange, purple, purple. The core of this pattern is orange, purple, purple. I can take that core and
and group the pattern to see it through. There it is, and there it is. Our next pattern, size, as our attribute. I have big, medium, small. Big, medium, small. Big, medium, small. I'm going to take a look and find my core here. I hear three different sizes in there, so maybe let's make a core like this. I think that my core is big, medium, small, big. Do you guys think I have it right? Uh, let's see if that repeats. The next one should be a big, oh, I didn't get it. Let's try it again. Okay, let's try this one out and see. Big, medium, small. Let's see if it repeats. Big, medium, small. Big, medium, small. There it is. The core of our pattern is this piece at the front. Big, medium, small. That repeats all the way through. Now, as you notice with each of these patterns, the core is just a small piece at the beginning that's being repeated. I don't want to make the core the whole pattern like this. My whole core isn't big, medium, small, big, medium, small, big, medium, small. Technically that can repeat again, but our core is focusing at what's at the beginning that's repeating. So we don't want to circle the whole pattern or two cores of it to say that it's our one. We just want to focus on what's at the beginning that's being repeated. So our last pattern that we have here is using um, pictures for our pattern as our attribute. So we have star, sun, moon, star, sun, moon, star, sun, moon. I'm going to find the core. Our core of this pattern, let's see if we have it, is star, sun, moon. If I have it right, it's going to repeat the same right after. Star, sun, moon, star, sun, moon. There it is. 